he was probably the most memorable man I ever met. Just to relay a story that Roger had mentioned. Uh, if you hadn't talked to Lou, it didn't matter how much time, and you bumped into him or called him, it was as if you had talked to him yesterday. Roger had said that that was Lou, that's just how he was. Um, he created a lot of bonds between a lot of people that are here in this auditorium, and people all over the country. I, Mike Aquinas, Roger, John Brennan, John Schnell, Ed Schnell, uh, list goes on. I saw Tim Chambers, uh, Roger talked to uh, uh, Bill Arata, and the thing that always struck me when I had an opportunity to run for Lou was the fact that uh, people would always come back. I, I, I'd see these guys come in, and they'd come and run with us. They were students of lose. I remember Bill Arata always coming back and going for runs with us. He created bonds that have lasted a lifetime. Uh, Lou was just simply the most memorable guy I ever met. I mean, he had a smile that was infectious. Uh, he always made you feel good about yourself. Always. That was. I think the reason he was such a great coach, certainly the reason he was a great friend. I can tell you words can't express how I feel about him. I know some of my former teammates, Roger, John, uh, all of you guys. Uh, it's amazing looking through albums that he had pictures going back to the early 70s and Seeing how many people he touched, uh, I feel very blessed to have known him, and I'm going to miss him.